Hello, fabulous friends and fans. Welcome to the all new monthly horoscopes. Now, these horoscopes are starting off as an experiment in the last three months of 2011. If you like them, please share them. And of course, you can always let me know that you'd like them to continue into 2012 on Facebook, Twitter, and of course, on my website, NadiaShaw.com. It'll be a great month. Enjoy. Hello, fabulous Cancer. Welcome to your monthly horoscope for the month of December 2011. I am your astrologer, Nadia Shaw. Thank you so much for being here. Since 2008, Cancers have been in a cycle. Now, this is a really long-term cycle. It's going to take you right to 2024. And it is a once-in-a-lifetime cycle. You are not going to see it again unless you live another 200 years. At least, <laughs> you're not going to see it again. And what's really great about this cycle is you get to really deeply examine how you are in partnerships, how you are in relationships, what your expectations are of the people that you love, and what your expectations are of love in general. And this month, that lesson, it comes on very strongly and it comes on full force. What's really great about this vibration and what's really great about this indication is that where the love is real, it will be made stronger. But where the love is not really genuine, it is likely to leave, thankfully so. You are in a very long-term cycle where what you want from a partner is real and you want somebody who's going to be honorable and ethical, somebody who can be in a spiritual partnership with you where you can mutually help each other transform and be better and truer versions of yourself. You're redefining what partnership is going to mean to you now and in the future. Wherever a partnership hasn't been absolutely loving and mutually supportive, and wherever there has been some deceit, the lights are going to come on. You are going to see the truth. And wherever you feel that you have given your power away in some way, you are going to reclaim that power. Now this is truly encouraging. Those of you who are in established relationships are going to experience these, these changes and these cycles within that bond as you come to know this person much more deeply and you come to see them more fully. But those of you who are not in an established bond are likely to have these realizations within your own heart, within yourself. However, I am seeing the very strong possibility that early this month, for those of you who are single, early this month, you're going to have an attraction and it's going to take you on a journey where at the end of the month you get the insights that you need facilitated by this person. Whatever you do, please remember relationships are a mirror. Their point is to show us who we are and what we believe about ourselves essentially. So try your best to the best of your ability not to make it about the other person. Whatever lessons should arise for you, not to make it about the other person. Keep it about yourself how your expectations created or contributed to a situation. Again, I'm going to say, ultimately, you're moving towards more honest, mutually empowering relationships. And that is really the kind of love that we all want. You're moving in the right direction, and that is truly hopeful and truly very inspiring. Welcome to my brand new show, Nadia Shaw Productions, featuring inspiring, positive, and uplifting people, places, and events in astrology, new age spirituality, and art. Catch full episodes, daily horoscopes, and so much more on my website, NadiaShaw.com. Until we connect again, take care.